Good day to all of you. Today I'm discussing with you how to cut out negativity in the final chapters. That's chapters 8, 9, and 10. If you've reached this uh, final chapter, I assume you have watched or listened to the um, How to Cut Out series. And if not, i leave the links in the description below. First is chapter 8, Get the Here and Now Mentality. People tend to regret the mistakes they have done in the past and strive to protect themselves from the future. This action prevents them from seeing and taking advantage of the amazing opportunities that the present brings. The following will help us understand more about the here and now mentality. The now. There are things in life that are worth waiting for. However, there are also things that are worth doing right now. Practicing the here and now mentality shows you to be mindful and conscious. Mindfulness enables you to focus your attention on the moment. It is a moment-to-moment -moment awareness of the activities that is being practiced in any occasion. It will promote strength, energy, and calmness that are essential in stabilizing everything in life. Practicing the here and now mentality requires discipline since it involves engaging in exercises that will improve the capability of an individual to be mindful every day. It also requires removing your attention from the past and the future in times when they are not needed. When focusing on your present life, it is vital that you are aware of the time that you need to accomplish your goals. It would also help if you practice mindfulness when dealing with your emotions, thoughts, and reactions. Conducting certain exercises can also help you to be more present. These include meditation, being a conscious observant, and taking a deep breath. Chapter 9 Use affirmation to stay on course. All individuals can use affirmations to live their best life. Positive affirmations are positive and powerful statements and thoughts that they can use for improving their personal wealth, spirituality, spirituality relationship, health, and career. The capability of people to remain positive and keep positive thoughts can determine the status of their emotional life. The following can help you understand how you can use affirmations to stay on course when it comes to successfully achieving your Be Positive resolutions. Affirmations defined. Affirmations are statements that aim to reprogram the subconscious, the subconscious mind of individuals with positive thoughts so that they can eliminate any negativity that prevents them from going after their dreams. Positive affirmations can make you feel stronger and help you make the most positive and wisest choices. In Tagalog, affirmation is pagkumpirma. It would be easier for you to achieve whatever you want if you use positive visualization and affirmation in everything that you do. This is considered as one of the most powerful and effective strategies that you can take advantage of if you want to change your life for the better. You can create your own positive affirmations with the use of simple languages to express or showcase the message that you want to convey. It is advisable that you make your affirmations in a clear and concise manner and written in the present tense. You also have to make sure that they are written in a first-person narrative. For example, I can do it. I will survive. I am strong. I am happy. I will close the sales. My business will grow. Whatever you dream of, you'll be closer to attaining such dream if you have a positive focused mindset. Last chapter, we have the benefits of your being positive. 
Being positive provides numerous benefits to your overall well-being. This is an important factor that directly affects the perception of people when it comes to creating a life that they want. Being positive may sound simple, but it is actually not easy. However, once you become one, you can see several improvements in your life. The following are some of the benefits that you can get from being positive. One of the benefits of having a positive mind is that it creates harmonious relationships. This is because having a positive attitude allows you to see the positive sides of various people instead of flaws and mistakes. Another benefit is that positive people can maintain a broader perspective and effectively identify solutions to various problems that they have. Being positive also promotes better health, reduced stress, and improved focus. Positive people tend to handle things better than negative people. They are able to concentrate better in finding solutions instead of being distracted by negative elements. Moreover, they, the, the way people think also have a direct impact on their health. That is why if you conquer negative thoughts, you will have a lower chances of suffering from different kinds of diseases. Aside from this, you can also face any stressful situation with an, an improved focus. This helps you worry less and cope better. Positive thinkers are also more resilient. This means that they have the ability to overcome adversity or cope with problems. Instead of losing hope and giving up, they do the best they can to find an effective way to fix their problems. Best of all, best of it all, being positive gives you the power to change not just your environment but your life as a whole. This can result to a more successful and happier life. The benefits that being positive provides can never be underestimated. Altering your current behavior and attitude into a positive one will greatly help you in bringing productive changes in all aspects of your life. Hope this helps you in some ways. Stay safe, stay healthy, and God bless us all.